Otis Gold is a publicly listed company. We trade on the TSX Venture Exchange up in Canada. Our trading symbol is triple uh, O, 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 O. Uh, we've been a public company for three years now. We're focused on developing uh, gold projects in the state of Idaho. We have five uh, projects. Our flagship project is the Kilgore Gold Project. Uh, the Kilgore Gold Project is a volcanic hosted epithermal gold system. It's on the northeast margin of the Kilgore Caldera. To give you a geographic touch point, we're about 70 miles north of Idaho Falls. The Kilgore Project was previously explored uh, by uh, Echo Bay, Placer Dome, Pegasus Gold. When we came to the project three years ago, there was about 34,000 meters of historic drilling on the project. Since then, we've done about 12,000 meters of drilling. And this year, in 2011, we're uh, implementing a 10,000 meter drill program out there. Uh, Kilgore hosts a 487,000 ounce 43101 compliant resource that was uh, completed by a prior operator. Uh, we're in the process of updating that 43101, uh, which will be available early this fall. In terms of the capital structure of the company, we have 42 million shares issued uh, and outstanding. We're trading right now at about uh, 40 cents a share, so we have a valuation less than uh, $20 million per ounce in the ground. We're trading at about $20 an ounce in the ground. The market right now is trading at about $130 an ounce in the ground. So from a valuation perspective, it's clearly uh, very much a valuation uh, or a value play. Uh, with some significant upside as we continue uh, to build out our, our resource at Kilgore. Uh, we also have a plan to, uh, from a strategic point of view, to become the preeminent uh, exploration and development company in the state of Idaho. And to accomplish that, uh, this season we're also doing a program of generative exploration work, which will, I expect, uh, will result in us adding some additional projects to our property uh, portfolio as we move forward. One of the uh, perceptions that people have of Idaho is that it's very challenging to permit uh, a new mine in Idaho and to uh, allay some of those concerns. Uh, in 2010, uh, we hired Golder Associates, a well-known consulting firm, to go out and address the situation or address the question of are there any material impediments to permitting an open pit heat leach operation out at Kilgore. Uh, they came back uh, at the end of last year uh, with a report a very detailed report uh, that came out with uh, findings that suggested that there are no material impediments to permitting an open pit. Kilgore is very well located. Uh, you can drive a two-wheel drive vehicle right up to our drill site. We have power uh, to the bottom of our hill. Uh, we have lots of water on site. There's a railhead 15 miles away. There's an interstate 15 miles away. So from an infrastructure uh, perspective, uh, the Kilgore project is very, very well located.